Reunion volcanic eruption has intensified. That is in the uh, Indian Ocean. Uh, yesterday, we know we were notified by this uh, appearance of this uh, ash cloud or something like a fumarole activity. Then, from a distance, you could see some fissure eruption, which, in close inspection through the airplane, we saw the actual lava fountain oozing out of the ground. Closer, you can see that how it looks. Underground, it appeared that is a fissure, completely clear, very similar to what we saw in the Meridor Valley and the, in the Gelding Nedaler Valley, uh, but more intensified and more active. And the cones are already there, the volcanic uh, craters are already there. The intensified activity is, uh, is clear from this uh, lava flow, very fluid, and it shows that it's very hot and at the same time very silica poor silica is like a glue is like a gluten it practically bonds things together and when there is not much silica the lava flows very quick and uh, runny uh, in the night that was amazing you could see from a distance it was like you are, you are looking at a highway or something like that and the fountain of the lava was going probably around uh, um, 20 30 meter into the sky this is a Island, which is practically based on a hot spot in the Indian Ocean, is where the actual uh, uh, Deccan trap started in the India, and when it is separated from Africa, uh, part of it, which was uh, responsible by this hot spot, stayed there, and is yet active, is yet building the ground. Uh, probably after the Hawaiian volcano, this is the most active volcano in the world and uh, the geological mapping of it we can see here this is the tectonic map of the indian ocean mid-oceanic region the reunion island uh, piton de la Ferne is the name of this cone that is active now and it has already suffered in the past a caldera collapse as you can see on this side toward the east so this is the recent development on this volcano and that is a update